Oh, well, so I've lost uh, 20 to 40 pounds in uh, three to five months, roughly six times in my life, and five times in the last ten and a half years. So this is this is what I understand, of course, also from my background from being a doctor and also having been in a PhD in exercise science uh, at Arizona State. So here are the five things. Number one, uh, the energy balance equation applies in most cases, more than 95% cases. Most likely it applies in your case. So instead of uh, you know looking for excuses as to why you are one of the exceptions, uh, believe in it and uh, set up a calorie deficit per day and most likely you will see results. Number two, uh, <clears throat> diet is the more important component of losing weight than exercise in terms of calorie deficit per day. 70 to 90 percent of uh, the work is going to come from the diet side and the rest could be from exercise. I will talk about the type of exercise that works best. Uh, number three, uh, based on the calorie deficit equation, you could you can lose you know one pound if you have a 3500 calorie deficit. Now you can spread it out over 10 days and you have just one pound lost in 10 days. In that case, it will be difficult for you to monitor if you have actually lost 10 pounds, I mean one pound over 10 days and just three pounds in a month because there's so much of variation in our weight in fluid and solid retention per day. So I recommend initially trying to set up a cal calorie deficit of about 1000 calories compared to your steady state uh, when you start so that you can easily see two pound or one kilo, uh, 2.2 pound or one kilo uh, weight loss per week. If you can see that, you can uh, believe in the calorie deficit and the energy balance equation and you can keep up your motivation to continue with your dieting. Uh, now, what type of exercise works best? Basic thing, I think that your exercise should be sub-moderate intensity. So low intensity or sub-moderate intensity over a decent amount of time. Uh, for me, walking is number one and you know, walking with all types of variety I talk about moving your hands about walking backwards and everything and uh, to that I add strength exercises more for the upper body not so much for the lower body uh, so upper body strength so that you are feeling fit at the end of having lost weight rather than you know being uh, totally weakened by the effort of uh, weight loss okay so uh, one hour of gym or outdoors gym or you know moving walking with the cat dumbbells or uh, cobbles or any kind of free weight exercises for an hour with you know all kinds of breaks is about burns about the same 230 or 250 to 300 calories that a walk would do so split up you know three days or four days walking a week and maybe two or three days uh, doing energy i mean sorry uh, strength exercise for the upper body so Again, so those are the basics of uh, weight loss in a nutshell. Okay, and I'm gonna do some of my uh, daily routine on the bars now. Uh, leave any comments or questions, uh, like, subscribe. Uh, Doc Star's channel is now going to be moving more towards the other side of my uh, <laughs> doctorate, which is uh, the medical uh, health side. But I will still be posting my uh, music videos whenever you know I get the time this time I'm teaching uh, three courses okay so ciao for now